Okay guys, so here is another example of why you need to know your prices and check the tags. So this is the store brand of semi-sweet chocolate chips. This is the brand I normally get because it's the cheapest. It's a 24 ounce bag. They taste fantastic, but the price went up. So it's $8.49 for the 24 ounce bag of store brand. But if you look at this, this is the Nestle's Toll House. Right there, Nestle Toll House. Same size, 24 ounces. See that? Same exact size. Same product, semi-sweet chocolate chips, $7.99. And it's not on sale. That's the regular price. So it's actually cheaper to buy the name brand. And you can even tell another way to look is by looking at the unit price. So this is $5.33 per pound. And if you look at the other one, it's $5.66 per pound. So even looking at the unit price, you could see that it's cheaper. Unbelievable. So most people, when they're looking to save a buck or cut their grocery bill, they go for the store brand. But yeah, that's not always the case, especially if they just raised the prices. This is even cheaper per pound, $5.15 if you get the biggest one. Um, but yeah, if you're comparing apples to apples, the same size, 24 ounce, 24 ounce, the Nestle Toll House is cheaper. So don't automatically grab the store brand because it's not always cheapest. Now, if you look here, this is the 11 and a half ounce bag. The name brand is 489, same size, 489, 11 and a half ounce. And the store brand, 11 and a half ounce is 449. So it's actually cheaper to get the store brand for the smaller bag. But if you're looking at the big 24 ounce bags, get the name brand. Look at your prices, people. Don't just grab the store brand thinking you're saving a buck. You have to look at the tags. Anyway, just little tips that I wanted to show you in case you're watching your grocery budget because everything is so expensive. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.